It's time for CBTV now. Jordan. And I'm Amani. We, we are your CBTV anchors. A very happy birthday to Lauren, who is celebrating her birthday today. Come to the office for your birthday pencil at your CBTV. I'll say a very happy birthday to Miss Stone. Have a great birthday. Next, we have the question of the week. Who is on the $100 bill? Please turn in all answers into the orange box in Mr. Tom's room. The winner will be picked this Friday. Here is Mohammed with today's weather. This week is turning out to be a beautiful week of weather. Look for highs in the low 70s with lows dropping down into the low 50s tonight. We will see mostly sunny skies on this first day of fall. Have a great day, Christy students, and back to you, Winkers. Next, we have today's joke of the day. Where do penguins go to dance? I don't know. Where? <laughs> the snowball, of course. <laughs> <laughs> nice one. Speaking of penguins, what did what is a penguin's favorite salad? I don't know what. Iceberg lettuce. <laughs> <laughs> okay, enough with the penguin jokes. Next week, next we have a very special announcement from Miss Rochenbach. Good afternoon, Crestview. This is Mrs. Rochenbach. Most of you know that I have been the voice of CVTV for the last several months. It's time for CVTV now. It's time for me now to pass on the honor of being the voice of CVTV to one of our very own Crestview students. Tryouts for the new voice of CVTV start tomorrow morning. If you are interested, please see me or Mr. Toms. We look forward to finding the new voice of CVTV. It could be you. Back to you, anchors. Here's your look at this week's pic Here's your look at this week's picture of the week. Take a moment and see if you can figure out what it is. Put in all answers into the green box in Mr. Toms' room. Make sure you include your name and your teacher with your name with your answer. The winner will be announced on Friday. Next we would like to welcome back Miss Brown to CBTV. Thanks. I brought with me one of my very favorite books, the book Wonder. I just finished it last night. Fourth, fifth, and sixth graders, I know you know this story or you're in the middle of it right now. What an amazing story about a student who comes to school for the very first time in fifth grade to experience school and he has an abnormality his face doesn't look very nice and he's so afraid and he's so nervous when he comes to school what others might say and do his experience at school might be like yours some days everyone's grateful and chooses kindness and some days your peers forget and they say words that hurt students I need you to always be respectful I need you to always choose kindness because that's the best place to come and learn to be with friends. And I also want to remind my fourth, fifth, and sixth grade friends, I've given you a challenge or an opportunity. We would like our very own Crestview School Pledge, a promise to each other about how we want to treat each other when we come to school. So if you've been working on it, fabulous. If you haven't started yet, please get started and think about entering your idea of a class or school pledge or promise. I'm really hoping that we can choose one that one of you students have created. We want school to be a safe, fun learning environment, just like Augie wanted the character in this book when he went to school. Back to you, anchors. Next we have today in history. On this day in the year 1930, flash bulbs were painted by 
Johannes Ostermeyer of Germany. The flash has come a long way since then. Today, most cameras have a built-in flash. Today's thought of the day comes from singer Ray Charles, who was born on this day in 1930. He says, what is a soul? It's like electricity. We don't really know what it is, but, it, but it's a force that can light a room. Please enjoy one of his hits as we end today's show. Thank you for listening. I'm Jordan. And I'm Imani. Have a great Tuesday. Take care of yourself. And stay responsible, respectful, and safe.